Okay, Jeet Kune Do guy is black gloves. MMA, standard MMA guy is red gloves. Funny that MMA now stands for the standard, whereas Jeet Kune Do, one of the OG MMAs, is now exotic, right? But anyway, just swinging wildly, both of them. Um, the school of backyard brawl right now, both of them are doing the style of. MMA guy went in for a low kick. Jeet Kune Do guy countered with two punches. That was a wild, wild haymaker that Jeet Kune Do guy threw. Oof. Punches have connected. MMA guy have, has connected with some punches. Fighting in this pummeling clinch range. Look at him grabbing the ropes. MMA guy grabbing the ropes. Ref's telling him not to do it. Oh, that was an elbow to the face. I guess that's allowed. Limited clinch time. So it's small gloves, right? It's small gloves, but it's limited clinch time. I love when the rules are slightly different than average. Both are orthodox. So karate, I guess those would be called close stance. Okay, um, MMA guy tried a spinning back fist or spinning hammer fist. Did not work. So far, looks like an amateur level type of match, right? You don't see something amazing, but obviously they've trained. A little um, low kick to a, almost like a Superman punch at the Red Gloves MMA guy threw. Come on, Jeet Kune Do guy. Everyone's rooting him to look like Bruce Lee. Which, by the way, if you look like Bruce Lee, ouch, overhand right by MMA hit. If you look like Bruce Lee, you're not doing Jeet Kune Do. The point of Jeet Kune Do is exactly what MMA is or what MMA was supposed to be, which is to incorporate what works, discard what doesn't work, right? Although, intercept, zia, right? So, um, I don't know. I'm, it's all complicated. There's so many politics when it comes to Jeet Kune Do. But anyways, the point is the guy with black trunks and black gloves claims to be Jeet Kune Do. Even though the guy in red seems to be moving a little bit more like a Jeet Kune Do guy. Just briefly. So, here we have... Looks like... Just... Jiu-jitsu, <laughs> not too much, right? MMA guys on top and just softening up the ribs. But Jeet Kune Do guy has his head, so it's kind of at a stalemate because you can't really get the guillotine. And now the MMA guy has advanced position a little bit. Uh, okay, so this is kind of the limited... Ground time type of thing. Trying to keep it interesting so it doesn't end up like jujitsu Again, we're trying to see Jeet Kune Do here. Although, if Bruce Lee were alive, he would have been the first to incorporate jujitsu man. So, Jeet Kune Do guy swinging from the hip. Whoa! 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 Ho! Ho! End of the first round. Okay, so again, look at that highlight, man. Why does the MMA guy look more kung fu and look more Jeet Kune Do than the Jeet Kune Do guy? This is so funny, but the MMA guy is an MMA guy, right? But again, maybe he embodies the original spirit of MMA, which is maybe his base training striking style was some sort of kung fu style. And then he had the wrestling and the jiu-jitsu. The Jeet Kune Do guy, I haven't seen any distinctness in his style, which is fine. But... I double-checked, by the way. I double-checked. The black gloves is the one that's Jeet Kune Do, okay? At first, I thought maybe I'd made a mistake. Like, the guy in red is actually Jeet Kune Do. But no. The guy in red's MMA. He says he's MMA. So, look at him. He's getting cocky. And he kind of paid for being cocky. So, they're in... They were in clinch position. Look at that little spin kick. He's doing some spin stuff, man. He's like, if you don't show Jeet Kune Do black gloves, I will show Jeet Kune Do. That's what I'm going to title this. We found our title. When the MMA guy is more Jeet Kune Do than the Jeet Kune Do guy. That's our title. We found the perfect title. <laughs> oh. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. The ref's going to stand it up, man. We know there's not going to be high-level jujitsu, so we don't even have to bother. So, unless he's going to attempt an arm bar here, which he's not. Yep, ref's going to stand him up. I mean, yeah. Why not, right? We're supposed to see Jeet Kune Do, and so far the MMA guy's done Jeet Kune Do. Well, I got semantics, man. Semantics are going to kill my commentary because Jeet Kune Do was supposed to be MMA, but Jeet Kune Do ended up becoming sort of cultish, sort of split into different camps, some emulating Bruce Lee, some trying to be MMA, and then MMA, oh, spinning 
Hammer Fist. MMA became all cultish, right? Like, they all look like Muay Thai fighters plus a little bit of wrestling and jiu-jitsu. Like, no flair, no mixing of martial arts, just a few martial arts. Um, our MMA... Oh, why would you pull guard on that, man? The MMA guy was going for a high crotch a little bit, then he got his um, head caught, and the Jeet Kune Do guy kind of pulled guard when he had no leverage, whatever, it doesn't matter. Ref's going to stand it up anyways. See, ref stood it up. 2014, guys, this was before all the controversy. This was before all the controversy when it comes to what is combat sports tested, what is real life, what is bullshito. I said bullshito, YouTube. Low kick by MMA guy. Oh, trying a little sweep. That was like Baji Chun. He was trying to Baji Chun sweep. Okay, it's confirmed. This MMA guy, he's definitely got some kind of Kung Fu foundations. I don't know what kind of foundations the Ji Kwon Do guy has besides, I want to say fail, but that's not giving him enough credit. Um, besides, oh, that overhand right somehow landed. Okay, five seconds, six seconds. Hmm. Okay. Of course, MMA guy won. Yep. So, MMA guy won. This channel stopped uploading many years ago. So, I don't know what kind of promotion this was. I promise you, I will do some more research on the two fighters to see what they've been up to. Especially our MMA fighter, because it looks like he's got some Kung Fu foundations or something, right? He didn't strike like a Muay Thai guy. So, we will do an update, and I will keep you guys posted. Anyways, this was a fun video. Who knew that we'd find an MMA guy that looked more like what we think a Jeet Kune Do guy would look like? Okay, guys, this is my commentary breakdown. Talk to you guys soon.